Testing, testing, here we go, new video, let's go. All right, where do I begin with this one? Because you might as well just grab some popcorn. You got a snack? No? I'll wait. Cool? All right, let's begin. School bathrooms, more specifically boys bathrooms, would be an entrance to a whole other dimension. The things that would happen would be indescribable. It would be so bad that so many kids wouldn't even want to use the bathrooms. Bro, my stomach hurts so much. Dude, go to the bathroom. Nah, I'll wait when I get home. And it was only 11 a.m. Homie had to wait like five hours. I was always the kid who would actually use the bathrooms in school though. I didn't care. I didn't want my body to shut down or, you know, an accident. However, after this one specific incident that happened to me, I stopped going to the bathroom in school, okay? <laughs> I was just casually minding and doing my business in the school bathrooms during lunch. And this whole group of kids just barge into the bathroom and they were loud. You know, they're banging on the doors and the trash cans. They continue banging the stalls and eventually get to mine. The other stalls around me were unlocked and not being used. So when kids would bang on the doors, they would open and go flying. But when they got to mine, of course it didn't open. Bang! Bro, I think someone's in here. Oh no. I lift my legs up in the hopes that they don't see me. Hey yo, someone's taking a dump in here. And I then get quiet thinking I can disappear. I know you're in there. It felt like I was in a torture chair. Cause I see one of the kids looking through the crevice in between the doors and they see me. And we make direct eye contact. I'm not even kidding, I was freaking out so much. And it only gets worse. Because some other dude puts his phone under the door with the flash on. Hey yo, what? I mean like, what are you even gonna do with that footage? I remember tearing up too. They'll eventually leave, they'll eventually leave, they'll eventually leave. Luckily the bell rings and I hear them leaving. But before before they left, they just had to do one more devious thing. They shut the light off. Oh, oh my god, I'm not even done yet and I have to go to class and now I'm in the dark. Yeah, I try to forget about that memory. However, I have some better memories in the bathroom. That just sounded really wrong. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> But hear me out, okay? Cause some fun things actually happened. Such as a concert with the boys. This one time during lunch, one of my buddies said this to our whole table. Bro, why don't we all go to the bathroom at the same time? Wait, why? Ew. It just sounds funny. For the boys. Okay, for the boys. We managed to get 20 kids in this tiny bathroom. We were jumping up and down yelling like a bunch of idiots. Some guy was flickering the lights on and off and we were just having a rave. Ew. Yeah, we're idiots, I know. <laughs> and I could just imagine the people outside just hearing us. Hey, yo, what on earth is going on in there? The bell rings though, and we have to leave. I felt like I was in a mosh pit from all the jumping. However, while we were walking to our classes, I told my buddies that we should do the same thing again. Bro, that was so dumb. Same thing tomorrow? Bro, we should have a concert. Yeah, Jorge, bring your guitar. Yeah, they knew I was a musician and that I played guitar. And what better way to show off my skills than to play in the boys' bathroom? An exclusive Horchata Soto concert. One night only, or one lunch period only. So the next day, I sneak my guitar into the cafeteria. And after we ate, we knew the game plan. I run into the bathroom with the guitar and all the boys follow me. We got ready, got in a circle, and sang a song. And you may be wondering, what song did we choose to sing? Well, none other than Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen. That's a cult classic, right? Everybody was filming and singing their lungs out. And again, you're probably wondering, what hip? There's no way that that happened. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here's the footage. We're such idiots. We were so loud. And all of my buddies were there. And more and more boys hearing us from the outside would come in because they were interested. They wanted to see what was going on. Now that's how you market a concert. And after that song was over, we had another rave. Someone actually brought a speaker and we turned off the lights. And we were using our flashlights as a little effect. <laughs> way too loud jumping up and down. It actually got really out of control. There were like 30 boys in this bathroom. And I was so scared thinking that I was gonna break my guitar. It was so dark. However, all good things must come to an end because the vice principal comes in and turns on the light. Everybody freaks out, but the vice principal is more confused than upset. Guys, what are y'all doing? People start running out of the bathroom while others start hiding in the stalls. <laughs> They literally stand up on the toilet so they can't see them from under. And I'm over here packing up my guitar as if nothing happened.
happened. And one by one, the rest of us are told to leave. And somebody from the outside recorded us leaving the bathroom. Our big exit. <laughs> And look at how many boys came out. Everybody was laughing. Let me know how many boys y'all counted. And what I didn't know until after the concert, the actual principal was outside of the bathroom. You can see him in the footage. And when he left, that was when I decided to come out. So it was cool that I didn't see him face to face when I was the one responsible for all this. And luckily, nobody got in trouble. Nobody was yelled at. The staff was just confused. And that's just a small taste of what will go on in our bathrooms. Yes, sir. Follow the Twitch and check out the new channel with Twitch highlights. Trust me, it's some good stuff.